over the edge Feel like I'm floating through the air Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to teach you how you can add color correction and sky glow in your montage. So first of all, if you don't have a light motion, please download it. Or else, if you don't know how to download a premium modded application, I'll provide a link in my description. And along with that, I'll provide another link which will tell how to open my links. So download the light motion and you will see search interface and sometimes it does like you cannot uh, add uh, videos greater than 1080p. So to fix that uh, issue you have to do this thing first click on the three buttons you can see on the left top corner and then click on about and then click on the three dots and re-evaluate video codec performance. After it is done, click on the plus icon and name your project whatever you want. Like we are going to do color correction. So I am going to write color correction. And then I am going to select 1080p and 60fps and create a new project. After creating a new project, uh, click on the plus icon and then click on image and video and drag your required video. So I am going to add my video which in which I have to add the color correction so here it is this is the iPad video so like it is not fit so to fit it you can go to move and transform and scale it up like this and you can add it I'm not going to do that I'm just showing you how to add the color correction so arrange your clips and after that what you have to do is you have to duplicate your layer so how to duplicate the layer click on the layer and you can see this icon click on it and click on duplicate layer now you can see the eye icon on the left hand side you have to hide the upper layer now the uh, low, uh, lower layer you have to click on it and you have to click on effects and add effect first of all you have to add brightness and contrast you will get it under color and light click on brightness and contrast and decrease the brightness around minus 14 after that click on effects and add another effect named as color temperature you will get it under color and light again click on it and increase the temperature around 10,000 like this then add another effect uh, I'm sorry I'm sorry <laughs> you have to add these two only and then you have to un unhide the above layer now click on the above layer and click on effects add effect and go to color and light and click on exposure and gamma so you have to increase the exposure up to 2 and keep this decreasing the gamma till 0 0.2 so like this you can see and now go to effects and add blur effect you, have, you can add Gaussian blur or else I am going to add fast box blur like this I am going to increase its strength around 300 0 0.300 and iteration around 2 now you have to click on the above layer and click on blending and opacity now click on lighten and linear dodge you can see it has it is having a glow but it is very distorted so now you have to click on uh, uh, hold the i button you can see it over here you have to hold it and you have to hold the both then you have to click on the group layer it you can see it on on the top corner the first it will group now click on the group and click on effects add effect you have to add brightness and contrast and then you have to increase the contrast around 0 0.30 after doing that click again on it and click on effects and add effect now you have to go to color and light you have to go to blur i'm sorry you have to go to blur and then you have to click on sharpen you have to do the strength around 0 0.9 now you can see it is looking uh, less distorted and like a color correction 
as you can see it is not much blue like you wanted so you have to click on the layer and then you have to click on the effects and add effect now go to color and light and click on colorize after going to colorize you can adjust like if you want it to be yellow you can do it here or whatever the color you want it is your choice so i'm going to do don't do too much it will do it a full blue keep it around like this to give it a perfect touch as you can see it and then you have to just export the video like this i hope you like my tutorial if you want any tutorial on particular part you can comment in the comment section i'll make a next tutorial on uh, from the comments only i am restricted fixed upon the web i need to kick the habit that my mind is breathing in